What's up, guys? And welcome to tonight's stream. Um, just up here, this gives a pretty good view of, uh, of, the, of the base from up here. You can just see it. You can see the, uh, the black marble wall we got. Again, I haven't um, made any progress, any more progress that I was making on um, switching over the, the flooring around it to black marble yet. And then I still got to switch over the inside of it. And I also want to just push this, um, push this back a little bit more. Not sure much farther to be able to go. Uh, it's already, it's already kind of reached the limit over here where it's starting to, where it's starting to go up. I want to like push this back just a little bit more, maybe like, uh, maybe like a couple wood floors back. So I haven't done that too, but um, put the title as Motor Mistland some more. So I want to do the uh, motor boss fight again because I want motors uh, trophy. So we'll do that. Maybe explore the missiles a little bit. Maybe do some base stuff. Um, yeah, just uh, just hang out and play some Valheim. Base is coming along pretty well. Got our lanterns over here. I got one here, and then I I just put up this one over there. I want to get a. I think I'm gonna just plant like a birch tree right here. Call it a day. Maybe I'll make it into grass and maybe add some of those like some of these over here. Then also, I think put a uh, path, make this into a path over here. We got the portal set up though. We're in the mountains, so I got full friend, uh, full friendress for our mountains adventure here. So we just gotta grab a few uh, dragon eggs. I also have fle uh, flesh rippers, so because I want to start working on that uh, fist skill. And just magics. Let's get our, get our elemental magic skill up. There's a stone golem right there. Actually, it does some decent damage to him. Maybe I can get a parry on him with that. Drop his trophy. Probably not. No. Some stone and some crystal. It's freaking blizzard going on right now. It's pretty lame. I have some dragon eggs marked down. And let's go over to grab those. Probably rolling around with the arbalist out and use it on Drakes to get our arbalist skill up. It's a wolf right there. skill up. So that'll be useful with taking out uh, diverters. So right now it is 11 plus 15. Drake. Alright, but let's just uh, delete Drake's. Well, so does the, sp the spear too, but I work on getting the Arbalist skill up. Where did that freeze gland go? Like all the way down here. Maybe it's up here. It's hard to tell with it being in, um, and with it on. Um, it could be in a blizzard right now. Here, which I already got. I got to put an X on it. Come on, man. Well, I put down there was another one over this direction. Let's 
There's like frost caves down there. Damn, we must have been up pretty high. This is frost caves. Search around for some more of them. Okay, so I'm going right. One of these guys is going to drop a trophy, man. Someday. Someday I'll get one. A skeleton. Freaking mountain climbing. Skelly boy just on the side of the mountain. Just chilling. Mountains are really pretty biome, but these uh, blizzards are just the worst, man. There's a streak. There we go. All right, there it is. I'm interested. Can I can, can I parry these attacks? Oh, I missed. I can hit the side of the mountain. Like, can I parry up? Can you parry? Hmm, I don't think so. I'm gonna try one more time. Yeah, you can, but it doesn't like stagger him, right? Just gonna go. I want the freeze glance. Man, lost another one. Not cool.
we go. Oh, I missed him. That would have been sweet. Oh, three of them, nice. It's a clearing up. Okay, all the nighttime in the mountains. Hey, world state coming in. Where did that freeze clan go? Hello. There it is. Nope. So the blizzard's clearing up. It is not. Blizzard is not clearing up. Get out of here. Should do is I'm just I'm still looking for a uh, mist, looking looking for dragons still. Say so go to I uh, go to the mountain that's close to where my base is and look for some two star wolves. So uh, that's a frost frost caves over there I think. Is that Skelly Boy down there? Let's just fly on in on him and just assassinate him. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's a frost case over there that I didn't mark down. I can mark it down. This guy's attention. Frost vases. Okay, frost caves right there. Just in case I want to try to get another, like, uh, get like a, a cultist trophy. Those look pretty cool. Maybe like just some extra Fenris. Drop that crap. One more D egg. There it is. Hey, got some wolfy boys down there, looks like. And some drakes, like three drakes, nice. Trophy. This freeze gland over here. Where the heck did it go? It's my freeze gland, man. Hmm. I'm gonna pay more. 
more attention. I got eight of them. That's pretty cool. And last, last D egg. Oh, there it is. It's like way down here. Don't need the trophies or the wolf belt. Oh, two star boy, what's up? Like way far, way too far, way too far from my base. That'd have been pretty cool getting a two star wolf. But I'm like, I'm pretty sure I'll be able, I'll be able to find one closer to my base. Another D egg, nice.
Oops, I dropped the coins too. I don't need, don't need coins. Uh, Devaith Fear, what's up, man? Um, are you going to fight Motor again for uh, the artisan table? No, I just want the trophy. Like, I got the uh, trophy over at the, at the Forsaken Altar, but I want one at my base, too. That's why. And, um, I saw your, I saw your comment, so uh, I'm glad I could help you out. That was a nice comment that you left. So, thank you. Yeah, I just want the trophy. That's why. And it'll uh, it'll it'll help my elemental magic skill too. I can work on getting that up if I take her down. I'm mostly using magic, like that's that's pretty much why. That's cool. Are you collecting every trophy? I would like to. Yes, that's the goal. I have every one of them. Excuse me. I have, I have every one of them except um, uh, motor and the queen. I just haven't because uh, I haven't bought the queen yet. But we'll get there. But yep, um, I'll probably move Bone Mass. Bone Mass's trophy is kind of freaking ugly. I'll probably put Motor right here. Motor's is pretty cool looking, big old dragon. And I'll probably stick, um, probably stick Bone Mass over there. No, nope. do this one. And I'm going to use uh, mainly probably the Staff of Embers against Motor. Maybe the uh, Draugr Fang Bow when she's like flying around in the air. Because it's kind of hit, kind of hard to hit her when uh, she's flying around with, with the Staff of Embers. Maybe I can get some shots on her though just to get my bow skill up a little bit. Or actually, I think I'm just going to use the Arbalist. Never mind. Let's use the Arbalist now. Get my Arbalist uh, crossbow skill up. When she's like flying around. That stone going there. That's a drill dude. Increase my fists. Eh, level 16, cool. Blood magic is getting up there, nice. And eh, got a D egg right here. D egg. I grab the other D egg. All right. Let's put this uh, first one over on the on this on this altar up here. Just hopping around, nice, nice. Beautiful day in the mountains. It's a stone golem right there. Oh, nice! I can battle it out for like a couple seconds here. No, oh, you missed stone golem. I just help the stray go. I don't think they do that much damage to him. Have a good stream, bro. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna sleep now. Alright, sounds good. Thanks, man. Thanks for uh, thanks for stopping by. Hope you uh, hope, hope you sleep well. Have a good one. No, no. Focus on the stone golem. See, you just got wrecked. You weren't uh, focusing on what you should have been. I could probably parry this dude with the uh, flesh rippers, but. If he's breaking the barrier, get my uh, uh, blood magic still up. I think I got some. What did I get? No, nothing. All right, no, no, uh, no, no levels. Okay. 
Let me put that there. Where's the next one? Oh, okay, there's a, a couple of them right here. Really close. Nice. Oh, missed them. So that was that one right there. And there should be another one just over here. Just gonna check around. Just make sure there's no other like stone golems hanging out. There'll probably be one that spawns in like halfway through the uh, motor fight anyway, so it doesn't even matter. So it usually happens. But there's this frost caves over here. You can like do this quick while I uh, wait on to like, just to get like um our food like all the way up. Do this frost caves real quick, so you can get a cultist trophy or something. I have the Fenris armor on, so like, if I get um, and I got, I, mean, I got the barrier too. But if I get hit by uh, some fire, it's, I won't be uh, totally screwed. This is cultist man; they hit pretty hard. If you get hit by their fire attack, and yeah, some, some stupid bats here. Bonk in my barrier. Come on, man. Bats are just the worst. They are the worst. Shots on these clowns in nope. Yep, I got a uh, set me on fire, but it's all good. Oh, did I get a trophy? Oh, I got a freaking trophy. Let's go. Let's freaking go, dude. Nice. It's like the only reason why I really came in here. Heck yeah. Closest I came to dying in this playthrough that I got going on, knock on wood, still haven't died yet. 
closest I came to dying on one of these cultists, I was like super early game. Super duper early game. And I just came came in here with like I don't know, like freaking troll armor and uh the abyssal razor. Just making some plays. And I got hit by uh cultist. With that fire attack, he got me down to four health. I was freaking out, man. I was freaking out, but I could have done it I could have done a better job like if you're early game like that. I made somebody mad. If you're early game like that and you get hit by him, I should have had uh, the health, like uh, some um, medium health potion, like the medium health, uh, whatever, potions or meads, medium health mead. I should have just hit that immediately and that, that would have helped out, like with getting my health back up. And that was uh, super duper scary, man. I almost freaking died. Had four health. That was the closest I came to dying. That's why, like, um, if you can, if before you go into the Frost Caves, if you can, like, uh, just make it to the plains, grab some cloud berries, be, be careful, but you should be able to get at least, like, the root harness by then, you know? You've been, you've been in the swamp, so pl plains shouldn't be super duper scary. And you should have, like, the, maybe the, you got, like, the Huntsman Bow, which is really good. You can, um, maybe find, like, a Falling Camp that's kind of easier. That one, one that doesn't have, like, five freaking berserkers and a bunch of BS. And grab some barley. And just make some uh, fire resistance barley wines. Beforehand. Before coming in one of these. Yeah, before getting into one of these um, frost caves. That would, uh, I mean, that means you're, you're basically guaranteed to, like, you know, if you get hit by a cultist, you're good. You're not gonna freaking die. They're not even probably gonna do that much damage with their fire attack. So that's what I would do next time. Before I come into one of these frost caves, so I don't have, uh... Because you're not gonna have full Fenris, you know, you gotta go into the frost caves to get Fenris. But I'd um, just make, just like, scout out planes, go to like a pretty, really, like a relatively easier falling camp, and grab some barley, grab some cloud berries, make some fire resistance barley wine, and then uh, start coming in here. If you want, just want to be like careful, you know, if you care about not dying and not losing your uh, your skills that you've been working hard on. That was that frost caves. I think that's pretty much cleared out, but I came in, got the trophy. Got what I came in there for. What's up, Jelly? How's it going? Hey, I uh, went, so I went into, um, I visited uh, Waffles Discord, and if that, thanks a lot for putting that in there. That's really nice of you to do that, to uh, put in that I was streaming. That was really cool. Listen, so I saw that in there. Really cool. Thanks for doing that. You didn't have to, don't have to do stuff like that. That's really appreciated. I think it, I think that's alright. Like, you know, I don't mean to, I'm not, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna go in his Discord and, like, promote my freaking stuff. That was really nice. Okay, got those ready to go. Got our cool cultist trophy. I'll just deposit the stuff right now. Okay, this is getting switched out with that one. Cool. It's kind of big. I didn't realize how big it is. But it's not like it's not like too big. It's not like a freaking troll trophy or something like that. That's pretty cool. Digging it. This way. Probably need uh, probably grab some more obsidian at some point in time.
All right, look at all the... I made a bunch of arrows earlier. Fully stocked chest. That's pretty much what I'm going to use. Like, frost arrows, uh, needle arrows occasionally, and um, carapace bolts, and that's pretty much just what I'm going to use. I'm not going to bother with crafting any other ones. Because, like, late game, I usually end up just using... um the arbalist for the most part instead of a bow see so much hard mode we need a um, basic guidance so thank you for doing this all right uh great help to the volume community we're all awesome yeah awesome thanks jelly yeah he's got a i haven't i haven't i should watch some of his playthroughs he's doing like hard mode i think i'll look at try, try to i'll look at the uh settings that he's using is it just regular, like, hard, the, the, like, the hard mode, whatever, you know, you, the hard mode slider settings on there? I think I'll just put the spear, eh. I can just open up my inventory and hit, um, and hit one of these minor eider ones if I need to. Which I, I, I which I will. When I want to start really blasting on her. Okay. That ready to go. Okay, get a frost resist, couple of frost resistance meads. I'm gonna make some meads real quick. I'm gonna cheat. I'll spawn 20 black cores just to have the fun that you do. Okay, sounds good. Sounds good. Okay, so for uh, I just want to make a couple of frost resistance meads, so I need some of those. I need some uh, extra great ore pies. Um, I think some thistle. And uh, fire resistance barley wine. Do I have barley down here? No. Okay, I gotta, I gotta grab some barley from uh, the chickens. And you know what? I didn't realize that hens uh, they can they can consume dandelions. I've been just throwing those out. False smell from the swamp. All right. Freaking easy mode, let's go dude. The ooze delivery service, let's freaking go. Um, grab that. And that. Freaking ooze delivery, let's go. Where are they, uh, where are these clowns coming from? Probably like over here. Alright, there they're jumping around. Right. We got Frostner just freaking deletes these things. I think this oozer right here. I'll just delete them. I needed some more ooze too. Sounds ethical. <laughs> yep. They uh bonk me. Let the dogs out. I'm not gonna bring the uh, the wolves out for this. The the wolves will just get deleted, man. The poison damage, like I can just do this by myself. The, all the wolves will get. The, all those wolves will die. All the wolves will die if I brought them out for this uh, for this raid event. Am I not picking up ooze? Are those stones? I think those are stones. Grab a news. Yeah, we're good. Yeah, unfortunately, uh, wolves do really bad against this one. They do not do very well against it. But you can see here, like, dude, I got just fr just Frostner. Frostner just deletes them all.
Like, I think there's an oozer over there. Cool. 31 ooze. Let's go. It's the ooze delivery. Did I miss anything? Uh, a couple of necktails, whatever. I'm just gonna drop those. Some feathers, I'll take that. It's over here. Scrap iron. That's right, they drop, uh, it was dropped scrap iron sometimes. Um, I think I'd rather just have some scrap iron. Bob trophy, don't care. Necktail. Necktail. Love your love the love the your love the wolves. Just want fun, not drama. All right, that works. Got our torches over there on the dock. Yeah, that's like my, that's got, I think that's my favorite raid of that. Because it just brings you a bunch of ooze, man, and the ooze is really, ooze is good. For ooze bombs, or I guess if you want to make some poison arrows. I don't really make poison arrows, but if you uh, want to, you can make those too. I uh, put these away. Alright, what else uh, do I need here? Frost resistance, just some honey, alright. I was gonna grab barley. Let's do one thing at a time. Okay. Put those back. And then I just need, um, I need mage caps. And that, and my inventory is full. So I drop some stuff off. Resistance barley wine, so just gonna grab some barley. Yeah, I was saying, like, um I've been throwing out dandelions. Don't don't throw out dandelions, basically. Because I did not I didn't realize that hens, that's something that hens can consume. So I've been like just throwing all the dandel dandelions out that I uh, got. I didn't realize that we can hens eat them. So I could have had like a ton of dandelions saved up. But I didn't realize it. So that's even like uh, if you make a, a great orph nest, like a, a, you know, like you make a farm over at a great orph nest, like an automatic great orph nest farm. Uh, you can save. That's like another thing where we just can get passively is uh, the dandelions. Hey, okay, uh, I don't need that many great orph eyes. You know what? I don't even. I don't need a portal on me. All the ancient seeds just chuck them. Yep, yeah, just get, you just just get rid of the ancient seeds. Okay, that looks good. I'm gonna do um, I think I'm gonna do uh, two eiders and one stamina. For this. And there's enemy enemies nearby. Who the heck is nearby? This guy? Freaking get out of here, dude. Clown. What a freaking clown, man. I'm pretty sure I had dan I have did I have dandelions in here? I yeah I got dandelions right there too. Nice. Didn't even realize it. Guy was snooping around. 
Saying that I dropped all uh, skelly trophies after 20 stacks. I mean, yeah, you need them for the mist lands. You do. I think you, you need them for, um... Where is it in here? Yeah, the unfading candles. You need it for that. And then you also need it for uh, that dead razor, but I, I don't know. I don't freaking bother making that thing. Oh, some, somebody's, man, somebody's whacking on my wall out there. Come on, man. Goon. I went AFK, I went AFK a little bit earlier today and just got almost a full, full reinforced chest full of resin now. It's pretty cool. Alright, rest in. I'm just gonna like just sleep through it and start it, set this boss fight in the next day. So basically, I'm gonna be using magic. And when she's uh, just flying around in the air, I'll probably just take the arbalist out and start blasting. Area, make sure there's no like stone golems hanging out. Take care of any wolves. Hear a wolf up there. There's a drake over there. Oh, there's a dragon egg right there, huh? So much luck if you. If you burb three times around, I need that for my lottery number. I'm not sure what you mean by burb. Burb three times in a row. Alright. So we're ready to go. There's a drake right there. Take this drake out. Hello. Never. Let's go get the freeze going later. You know what I didn't grab is another um, mushroom omelet. Uh, I'm just gonna be smart. Like I'll just grab one more. I didn't grab an extra mushroom omelet. Release burp. What? If you burp three times in a row. In a row? I'm not sure what you're talking about. She like spawns in the air, right? Not on the ground. All right. Maybe she does spawn on the ground. I don't know. Nope, in there. The spawn looks like. Some way to do. I'm just gonna do her like breath attack. Yeah. It's a Drake right there.
think it's going pretty well. Switch over the Arbalist. And get out of there. Okay, I can use uh, one of those Iger meads again if I want to. Which I'm going to. Yep. Just go ham. Sick puppy. Oh, uh, okay, got. It. Sorry, guys. I was uh, focusing on that there. Burt Belch, Lancer. Lancer said, "Marathon your last two videos, and I was looking forward to a live one, but I'm a. Uh, you're at work, FML. I'm sorry, dude. Um, I saw your comments, so sick puppy. Uh, thanks for leaving some comments, man. That's uh, that was very cool. I'm glad you've been uh, liking. It. Glad you've been watching the videos. So, uh, last attempt to English natural release gas from compounded acid or air. LOL. Sick puppy will need." Home time is still as good. All right, caught caught up on that chat there. Um, darn man, what do uh, what do you work? What do you do? That kind of stinks. Friday, uh, not Friday night, working. But it's not the end of the world. At least you're making some money. I was working two jobs for a year, and um, I always had to work on Friday nights. So I ended up just um. Just sticking with one job now, and it's been a couple weeks with that, and I can actually like enjoy us uh, Fridays now, which is nice. But that was very, that was very fast. I, I that was in under five minutes, I think, because I still have uh, Ike there up. Just freaking deleted her. Just a deleted motor. Dang. I can put that back. Grab one of these and now I can put up. Put up our trophy. Just like the whole reason for doing it. Alright, cool. So motor's gonna chill right there. I'm gonna stick bone mass over here. Cause uh bone mass is kinda ugly. Own own company have uh eleven employees six days a week. Dang man, here twelve hours a day, that's a lot of that's like that is some long some long shifts. Alright, so bone mass is freaking ugly self is up there now. Got motor there, hanging out. Some 
drop that stuff off. Okay, cool. So that was uh, one of the things that I wanted to do tonight. Um, I'm gonna go check on this sap. Let's go check on this sap over here. That's another thing that I want to do is get some more black metal scrap. So that's why I, I appreciate you. Alright, thanks Jelly. Sounds good. Oh yeah, okay, so I switched, I uh, actually made this kind of decent looking, um, I should probably put some torches, I can get, uh, maybe I can just get, like, there's a y'all around, you know what, I'm gonna go back quick, but uh, maybe I can just grab some copper from, uh, that diverger base that I took down and bring over and put some sconces up there. I think actually I might do that. The first thing, I'm going to switch over to that root harness. Since uh, we're going to go in the mist lands for a little bit here. Put the uh, wisp light on. Grab a portal. I did some farm, I did some wood chopping earlier in the plains, so I grabbed like a bunch of fine wood from the plains earlier. I gotta make sure now. Okay, yep, I can make a portal, so we're good there. Rippers. I'm gonna put that back. It's just the normal mislands, normal mislands gear. Okay, I got portal on me. Got some extra food. There's a y'all around here somewhere. Sounds like there's a y'all around. But, um, so I, I actually put, like, a spot for a portal here. Made this little portal shack. And then I put in chest, um, our black metal, and then uh, the extractors, and then what I need to make, uh, a blast furnace. I just put that in here. Is this a, uh, okay, it still says it's fading. I'm gonna, I have these, uh, chests set up. So I have the extractors in here with a workbench so I can take them down. I can take down the extractors if I want to. I'm just going to wait till it says that it's pulsating to put the extractors back up. Like, what does this say? Fading. Alright, yeah, I'm just going to wait till it's pulsating with energy or whatever. But, got the extractors in there. Just made those, uh, and that's probably, you know, not really necessary, but... Just made, uh, made it look a little bit better. Same thing over here. It just says it's fading, so I'm going to wait till it says it's uh, pulsating with energy to put the extractors back on. And the goal is to have, like, three or three, at least three extractors on each one of them. Because I have, uh, I think I, I'm pretty sure I have enough to do that. Yeah, there's definitely y'all around here. Let's see if we can find this guy. Yeah, he's like right over there. I'm just gonna hit a barley wine right now. 
he is. Can get some stam. Got a good one on him. Yep. Okay, deleted those. Fire attack. Freaking spear time. You're dead. Bonk. Got ya. Freaking easy, dude. There's an ancient root right here. Oh, I already marked it down, okay. I already marked it down. Sounds like there's a secret soldier around. Yeah, he's right over here. Secret soldier's right here. right down there. Pretty close to my to my stuff, man. Too close. Alright, before I switch over, I'm just gonna like throw some fireballs at this guy. Switch over foods. He's like walking around right there. Okay, no, not next to my stuff. One over here. Maybe down here. Sucks. Got him. There we go. Bunch of copper scraps still here. I actually just have a bunch of uh, regular old copper too. That's pretty cool. I only need a couple of sconces, but I think I'll just bring back as like much as I can. As much as I can carry. Which I think is 11. 
Yeah. All right. Actually, um. Hmm. Actually, uh, I only need two. I only need two copper for uh for a sconce, and I'm gonna need six copper for a forge because you need a forge to uh to place it. So I should have enough to make two sconces. Awful last stream was massive. Sailing was epic. Thanks, Jelly. I'm telling you, man, like sailing around the mistlands, that sh that stuff's like, I don't know, it's kind of annoying. Like that that'll test your freaking sailing ability, man. Um, okay, just gonna grab uh, grab what I need for a forge so I can put these sconces up. But thanks, Jelly. Yeah, sailing around the old mislands. Like, I would much I, I don't know it'd be way it'd be way easier just to find a couple of copper deposits. But that's I just can't do it, man. That's so boring. And um I think I I brought back like You don't get annoyed, nah. Nah, I don't get annoyed. It's not worth getting annoyed over. Um and when you, I feel like it's worth it though, on like a really long, like that was a pretty long boat trip. But it was, it's worth it if you can, like I basically almost filled up an entire long ship full of copper scrap. So when you bring that much back, it's like, it makes sense to do that. That was probably, I don't know, like at least three or four copper deposits full of, um, of copper scrap, or of, uh, of copper, you know, bringing that back. So when it's that many, like, that is kind of, eh, it's kind of worth it to do. And it just needs, like, some resin. Well, let's bring, like, a bunch. I got so much resin, man. Let's bring, like, bring, bring a bunch of resin. Uh, some more wood. And we'll put down some, to some... I mean, I could put sconces on all of them. That, that'd probably take a little bit too long. I can do that on my own time. I'll just get, like, some sconces up. I think that wouldn't take, that wouldn't take all that all that long. Only, the only sconce only takes, like, two, two copper scrap. It doesn't take that much. Okay, it's going to say I'm carrying too much. It's all right. It's a stone. Put two sconces here. Te technical advisor, the husband that had our sales right point. Nice. Nice. Let's make him do the sailing. So we got, I got six copper, I got seven on me. Um, okay, let's put, I'm just gonna put down a chest, like. Now let's put another, I put another chest on this side. For, for now. No. 
Thanks, I think it looks I think it looks alright. Looks alright. Better than just um just a portal sitting there. Okay, put uh just some basic torches down for now. And I can go grab that uh copper scrap like later on. If I want to, I don't need uh, I don't know why this why that guy's hanging out there it doesn't need to be. Okay, that one says it's still fading. So I was gonna say, I was gonna put the extractors back on it since it's like pulsating with energy. Still trying to figure out like what's the best way. But I think the I don't know what I've been doing. What I, how I'm thinking about doing it is like just put like three of them on there, and when it's pulsating with energy, put them on. Uh, let them get to full. And uh, just leave them on there until they're either full of sap, like all three of them, or it says, or or that it uh, says that it is um, em that it's all dried up, and then just take them off, let it get back to pulsating with energy, put them back on, and just like repeat that process. We're getting a ton of sap. This one. Eye, eye lamps don't need refilling. Eye lamps. The whiffs, whiff torches? I mean, like the great or the great orf ones? Great orf eyes? What you mean? Blue. The the great off ones uh, take iron, I think, though. Like, I'd have to go get some iron for the uh, for the the blue standing torches. a good time to go and try to go get some more copper scrap. I mean, uh, black metal scrap. This might be some, like, fallings. Might be some fallings hanging out. And I need more extractors. I mean, I have more. I have extractors. Let's check. How many extractors do I have? Six. So I just, I need more black metal to put those down. This guy. Get out of here. Trophy. Nope, I need to. Where am I going? Okay. In the plains. Oh, two star guy, what's up? want the crossbow but like you said uh whist uh whist lights are great also okay yeah the uh, the arbalist the arbalist is the bomb you just need a black forge for it, it doesn't even take uh, refined iron should have got my rest buff but it's all good yeah you just need a black forge yeah the crossbow is one of my faves it's pretty cheap to make it just uh, it's just a wood some iron and not a whole lot of iron too. Wood iron and um, and root it takes root, so you get that from uh, those abominations. Uh. I 
that dude should be dead. Maybe, maybe not. There, he's dead now. Ah, oh, missed. Staff Frost is pretty good against death mosquitoes. Just like you just tap them once with it and they're dead. Making that making 20 black cores tomorrow. Alright, sounds good. Yep, 20 black cores, you'll be able to get all of uh all that miscellaneous, cool miscellaneous stuff like that. Okay, I have 13 in here. That is too heavy. Oh. Maybe I can bring back like three. Can I bring back three? Oh, 300. So 300. 300. All right, I'm just going to drop these coins. See if, uh, see if there's like any locks. Maybe. Maybe there's some locks. This is a pretty t small little plane. It's like a plain sliver. And there's locks and I'll probably just spawn in. Nice. Okay, crossbow skills getting up there. Nice. Back this locks me. And let's get a rested bot the rest opponents, get that going. Get this. Another locks over there. Another locks hanging out. Staff of Frost probably isn't going to do that much to him, but I can kind of work on my elemental magic skill, I think. Play tomorrow. I'm gonna play with you and Bruce Willis. Uh, Yippee Nice. Sounds good. Freaking love that movie. Die Hard. Awesome movie. Grab these dandelions. Is Die Hard a Christmas movie? Brother, 
bro, my bro just called. I missed it. I'm gonna have to call him. Uh, I'll have to call him later. I'm streaming. It's all good. Only a heathen would say not. Nice. Agreed. My answer. Oh, okay, pulsating with energy. Nice. Let's go. Which one? Okay, let's see. I don't think uh, that's this one isn't uh, next to my. That is not included in uh, my all uh, my freaking um, extractors over there, and I don't know if I'm be able to carry to get this. Hear me? Maybe we can drop. I think I can drop one wood, and I'll be able to get it. Yep. Kind of want to grab these cloud berries. Uh, carrying too much, huh? How about that now. Okay, I'm good. What's this? Fading. I think it just takes like a couple, maybe a couple in-game days. Alright, let's uh, just drop this crap off so I can free up my inventory here. So I just need an artisan table, which I have ready to go. And this for the blast furnace, which is ready to go. I should really uh, maybe take the hoe, maybe take the hoe and level this out, but it looks like I can just put it right here. Blast furnace. Just put it right there. How much, so much of the extreme gamers today? Where did the fun go? Yep, your pacer style. Right on. Okay, put that in there. Forgot to grab some coal. Grab 50 coal. Alright, cool. So I got that. Alright, I have four in here, ten in there, and three. That's 17. And I have six extractors, which is 30. So I need I need 13 more uh, black metal black metal scrap for those six extractors. Because each one of them takes five black metal. Too late, I was gonna hit him with the spear. Another lock 
chest down there. Get to the copter, yep. Yeah, falling. I still have a bunch of coal on me, man. That's dumb. Hmm. All right, that's that's okay. So this is, it's gonna like increase my carry weight too much. Got nine black metal scrap in there. I think I said that I need thirteen more. Why did iron make us? Uh, so bulky and head down. <laughs> I'm not sure. Some uh, some skill level increase. So that's pretty neat. Not sure which one. Eh, just to drop some of this crap off. Now let's pick that coal back up. I need to because uh, it's going to be pretty heavy.
What are those fallings that I took out? Yeah, they're right here. Okay. Okay, that's 11. I only need like a couple more. I know I can get a couple black metal scrap. Those fallings that are hanging out in that tower right there that I never went to. here. Another little tower that is kind of wrecked. Sorry dudes. Some, some of that wood.
Okay, that's one more extractor over here. Okay, one more over there. This one's gonna have three on each. Yep. Okay, it's just smelting. It's doing its thing. It's gotta wait till it's done smelting, I guess. And it's still baiting. It's kinda lame. Alright, cool, that's coming this that's coming along. Pretty well. Cool. Alright, so while that's doing its thing, um let's uh I'm thinking there was mislands down here, I kinda wanna check this out. This is its planes. That's mislands down there. This is definitely Mistlands over here. All right, let's go to this uh, portal 26. All right, I got a portal on me. Got a, everything that I want to bring with. Let's repair stuff. Grab some more bolts. Yeah, I can make a portal. Sounds like there's a yacht around here somewhere. Maybe I can get up. Get up high. He's right there, alright. Yacht is right there. Let's get some stamina. See y'all's floating around. Eh, let's just start blasting. Bag. 
something over there. It's like... Might as well, uh, get some... Might as well just... Oh. Didn't realize that the Arbalist out. I freaking nailed that here. It's a secret soldier right here. Also, I don't think they take that much damage to fire, but I don't know. I mean, I had Eider, I might as well use it. Get some help from the Burger Boys. I'm not going to do that much, but whatever. This dude's getting rocked. Yeah, did some damage to him. Guys, what do we got down here? Oh, a couple seekers. That rogue's almost dead. Petrified bone down here. It's rogue, a couple of rogues. And uh, frost guy. Okay. Who uh, went out over here? Did somebody come out? Thought I saw somebody go out. Maybe they didn't. No, this guy. I think it was that guy. Where's this clown going? Where are you going, dude? Where's this freaking clown going? Come on. This guy walking to me. Come on over here, dude. Come on over this way. With... Come on with me. Yeah, there's like... Eh, some boys here. Might as well probably use Ike there. That rogue is walking around. Rogue's walking. Our guy, all right. Uh, okay, they're separating. Can't really see him because there's a lot of mist. Where are you? No. Nope. Dead. Can we plant close to to burgers so they uh, protect crops? Yeah. Um. Yeah, I think so. Um. That's a good question. I'm not sure if uh, the ward prevents you from putting crops down or not. Not sure. That is a good question. Alright, Petrified Bone, not bothering with. Not bothering with it. I'll mark it down. Not bothering. Here is a seeker though. 
Your freaking seeker. Grab that soft tissue. I'm just getting uh, the rest of the. I have a I have a decent amount of refined iter going, and it's not much more that left that it left that I want to make with it. So the rest of my uh, soft tissue, I think I'm just gonna get from Deburger guys like these crates. Probably mo mostly from crates. somewhere I can freaking hear him. There he is. Oh I'm that guy alright. Soft tissue. Let's grab this. Okay, awesome. That's a pretty pretty decent amount of soft tissue. Everything else, yeah. I just want to grab the lanterns too, so I don't have to make another trip. That's an interesting question, Jelly. Um, I'm not uh, sure if you can plant crops close to them or not. Well, that would be kind of cool. You can like protect your crops for you. And the most important thing. The uh, lanterns. You know what? And I'm wondering, can I get a chain from this? Maybe they drop. Maybe it, they drop sometimes because I, I I've gotten the chain before from like some diverger thing, and I'm I'm pretty sure it was like pretty sure it was that. Maybe they just don't drop all the time. I don't know. Yep, follow me guys. Just gonna go in a circle here. Circle around the infested mine. Oh, 
might boop me. Not allowed. Not allowed to boop. No boops allowed. Alright, boop me too. Trophy, no. If we get here, we can empty a swamp crypt. Right. Is there any more? Any more uh, seekers hanging out? No. Some mage caps. All right, infested mine time. Let's go. Using the knife until I get until I max it out. Eighty-seven. All right. Cause I, I want to start using the pole arm too. I do want to start using that. Grab this guy and grab some of these. like restock on the I gotta make some more pretty soon here but they're really cheap gotta restock on those pretty soon just gonna pull the rest of it off never found an infested mine dang that is unlucky Some, yeah, it's probably some dudes down there. Oop. Another tick. Oh, come on, dude. Figure it out. Figure it out, man. Come on. Yep, there you go. There you go. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. Up here. No. Irish Xbox game. Any tips when fighting the queen? Um, haven't done it, but vids I saw. Got many bombs. Okay. For fighting the queen, um, there's a few, a few different ways you can do it. Uh, I like to do uh, magic. Um, so the when I when I've taken out the queen, taken out the queen like. Probably, I think four or five times each time. I just did a, I just did a magic build. So I did two, two Eider foods, and one stamina food. Um, with like, just work on your your elemental and blood magic skill a little a little bit. I think I was around like probably level thirty for elemental magic. But um, use the staff of embers, and uh, just kind of like I just I just stick on the um. Black cores. I just stuck around the bottom area of the mine of the, of the of the boss arena, 
and I put up a bunch of um a bunch of whiffs torches so I could eat there's gonna be a bunch of mist in there it's kind of annoying like it's kind of hard to see the queen so if you put a bunch of whiffs torches it kind of helps out with that it'll uh, clear out the mist a little bit and I just basically just go in a circle with the queen uh, get some shots on her with the staff of embers uh, there's gonna be seekers Okay, she'll spawn in a couple seekers at a time. You just gotta um, you know, take out her seeker mobs, ooze bombs, and bile bombs. There, there's gonna be seeker broods in there, and her like poison attack spawns in seeker broods. So um, ooze bombs and bile bombs just delete the seeker broods. You can also throw them at the queen just to like get some get some poison damage on her too. Uh, but yeah, just uh kind of keep your distance I guess I uh, and um take her down with magic make sure you're using your magic barrier you know keep your magic barrier up because you're not going to have a ton of health so that's one way of doing it you can also do uh, I think what I'm going to try what I'm going to do next time you can do like a combination of melee and magic so like uh probably do like one um one health food one eider, one good eider food like uh, the seeker aspic, and then one good stamina food, and um, you know uh, you'll, you'll get a couple of shots of like staff of embers on her, and when uh, when you're waiting for your eider to, to regen, um, maybe bring like mist walker that'd be a good one, that sword, and then uh, get her into melee for a little bit. You just gotta probably just dodge roll, just work if you if you're not comfortable with dodge rolling just um, work on that a little bit because you want to dodge roll their attacks that's another way of doing it I think that's probably a better way to be honest this probably does a little bit more damage but it's in a, it's I guess what at the end of the day too like what you're most comfortable with what you're most comfortable with doing. Like I was really comfortable with do with, with just doing magic on her. So that's what I stuck with. So that is, that was, those are my tips for uh, taking on the queen. Thanks, very helpful. Alright, cool. Go ahead, help. I don't want to be like Captain Obvious doo doo, but um, if you just, if you YouTube or good, like either Google search or YouTube search, uh, you know, Queen Boss Fight, um, there's one dude, I'm not sure what, it, I can't remember what his channel name is, but uh, it, it, it's like an hour long, but it's, ca it's called like, like Five Ways to Take Down the Queen, I think the you the uh, YouTube video and that basic that's a really good uh, guide to if you want to watch like a, a, a YouTube video on it like I will vouch for what he uh, what he says in there about taking on the Queen like it's some some good stuff he has five different ways of doing it that's what the, uh, the title of video is um, and one of them is like two a couple of them are basically what I just explained like either like magic mostly magic or a combination like melee and magic He has this one it's called uh, I thought it was kind of interesting The uh, the bone it was basically like the bone mash uh, bone mass rush method is what he called it but basically you just um, heavy armor and at bone mass, and the goal is to just uh, is to just like get her in a corner. And since you have bone mass, you take a ton of uh, like you have a ton of physical resistance, so you you can take a ton of damage, and you kind of just like um, you're just basically like a tank. And the goal is to just take her down like as fast as possible, but basically within the timer that you have for your bone mass ability, which is five minutes. But um, so we had that one. He didn't die, but his health got down. I I, I probably wouldn't recommend doing that if you're like taking on the queen for the first time because his health got down pretty low 
at times. Yeah, I think the best though, the fastest way to do it is probably a combination of magic and melee. But, um, but yeah, and then just, you know, they've got the mobs that will spawn in, which are kind of annoying. Uh, that ran out of resin. The seekers or whatever, but if you know what you're doing, if, you, if you've been spent some time in the Mistlands and you've been, you've been taking out seekers and take going into Fested Mines and dealing with seeker broods and, like, you know, if you kind of know what you're doing, you should be okay. Was that infested mine? Got uh, how many black cores? Three. That's not too bad. Glenn's games. Okay, Jelly's got it. Yeah, it's called like five ways to take out the queen. Some pretty good info in there. Some of it's a little bit uh, over the top, like, he, like, makes uh, an entire, like, uh, uh, base outside of it, basically, to get his, to get a comfort bonus. But really, I mean, all I need to do is just set up a portal right outside of it, and if you need to, um, if you need to, like, if the boss fight goes on pretty long, and you need to get your, uh, comfort bonus back, you just, like, portal back. Yep, uh, I'll look for that video. Yeah, I'm pretty comfortable with the, okay, yep, yeah, just check it out, man. It's it, it's honestly like it's a good video too. It's like worth a watch, if, especially if you're just curious about like what the boss fight looks like too. And it's a little it's a little old. It's probably like a year old, but um, I don't think it it, it like I I, I don't know. I did, I did the boss fight. It's probably been like a couple weeks since I've done it, but his info in there is pretty relevant still. Like it hasn't the boss. I don't think the boss fight's changed that much, if at all. Remember to like Vor for taking the time to make this stream. Thanks, Joey. On top of uh, on top of reminding. Thank you. What the heck? What's going on here? Where's this y'all at? Seeker, a couple of them. Just take them out. Y'all's right there. Just stand back. One of these. There's this y'all. There he is. Okay, big guy. Spear time. Yeah, you're mad. We can delete you. Deleted him. I got kind of heckin', dude. Freaking kind of heckin'. Some seekers showed up. Seeker soldier over here. Can I get a butt shot? Tell me I can get a butt shot on this guy. Probably not.
just gonna drop that tick trophy. anything over here so let's I think start heading north I just move and zoom in on the mini map just a little bit can hear uh, I'm like right next to the water oh, I'm wet man this lane Missed, can't really see anything. Anything down there? Not really seeing much. Something over there's a bridge. There's a bridge right there. I just uh, float on over there. Or not. It might be in the water. It's like pretty close to the water. All right, anything uh, cool over here? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Secret Soldier's mad. I think he'd only be mad at uh, burgers. Maybe there's uh, probably just like some random burgers down there hanging off. Bunch of mage caps right here. That's pretty cool. What's going on down here? One star guy. All right. Me off. He's that guy's dead. All right. He's dead. Makes sense.
I got it, the burger trophy. That's pretty cool. that oh some boys over here and no mist nice and a hair running around it's a lot of stone Dude, invisible spikes. Yeah, I'm just gonna blow them up. Take these spikes off. Okay. Alright, uh, mage, uh, rogue, rogue, mage. He's hanging out down here. Mage. Okay. I don't, I, don't, I don't think I need to do any uh, shenanigans here for this one. Take this robe. That's uh, these hair out though. This guy too. I want, I want this guy. Come on. There we go. Uh, fucking stone. Got the rogues out here. We 
You got live next day, it's normal mode. Not not many are doing that. Alright. Yeah, just just normal mode. Just just regular old Valheim. Alright. Noted. Alright, there we go. I don't care about that. Some soft tissue. What's going hard mode? That's never a good place to be too odd to begin. Alright. Hard mode. Yeah, I've never bothered with it. Maybe uh, so someday I'll check it out. Check out hard mode sometime. Okay. Let's get some wood. Even faster, just uh, go back and get some wood. Take it using the portal, but whatever, it's all good. All right, cool. Don't need that. Or that. On. I've got an extractor here. Yeah, certainly core, grab that. Oh my here. Not a lot of miss. Cool, we got another one over here. And some lanterns, nice. down. Okay, some rogues. Uh, that a couple of support guys. Alright. Not too crazy. Nothing too crazy. And one star rogue. the way he ate nice. Oh, okay. So there. Switch it up here. I'm gonna take this guy out first. And I'm probably gonna be running around quite a bit.
got me. Didn't see him. Oh, nice. They're gonna be distracted. I got the burger power. Oh, these guys aren't even mad at me. Let me just wait till they, uh, eh, I think it doesn't really matter. Is that other mage yet? There he is. Okay. It's probably, yeah, I got some missiles coming on down. It's all good. Whatever, I'm just gonna go over here. Who's missiles at? Just one of them. Hey, this guy's running around. Where you going, dude? And okay, there's the mage. Alright, uh, let's get out of it. Petrified bone here, but uh, I think it's just this like the rib cage thing. It doesn't actually have any uh, soft tissue in it. I want the seeker meat? Oh, oh, not stuck. I don't want to get stuck. I hate these petrified bones. I've gotten stuck in them before. Nice bunch of soft tissue. Awesome. This extractor, uh, let's drop that. It's a hair, took himself out in the spikes, I think. Somewhere. I don't know. Somewhere over there. And, uh, got some, got some lanterns, nice. Escaping. Mm, I'm just gonna drop these coins. And I don't really need a hair trophy. Just wanna just like bring this up. Just bring this up here. Test this out again. I'll see if I can get a chain from this. What? Too, too much. Uh, too much crap. All right. Oh yeah, here we go. Got one. Let's go. Awesome. Extractor's just going in that chest. Grab this chain over here. Um, I only need three wood. I'd rather just bring this lantern back. Okay. Turn. 
most important, most important thing. Extractor. Chilling. Oh, I'm just uh, some soft tissue. Cut off. Find so many mage caps, you just don't even need to plant them. Oh, what's up? Ran out of stamina. Wasn't paying attention to my stamina. Not cool. My, that's my kill, dude. What the heck? So I'll keep the coins for now. I'll keep them. If I gotta drop them, I'm gonna drop them. Oh, one star here. What's up? Get back here. Get back here. Oh, I'm wet. Dang. Don't like that wet debuff. I don't say it's only 15% stamina. I think it's 25% health regen. I don't really care about the health regen though. Stamina regen is annoying. Here we go. Come on, man. Don't don't turn around. Don't turn around. There we go. Get sick. Butt shot. Got his butt shot on him. Boom. Uh, too much stuff. Yep, I'm dropping the uh, coins. Here's a seeker somewhere. Not over there. Let's go around this way. That's that just looks like water. Supply up here. Oh, infested mine. Nice. Let's go. Mage caps. Okay. Missed. Switch over, get some stamina. Okay, I see a jelly. I'm just gonna, uh, I gotta. Let's see, focus on this for a sec. I see your comment though. Your, your chat post. Come oh, on, man. I have to go soon, but uh, you're the the best. Okay. So you're the best normal uh, normal mode streamer I've ever seen, and I've watched over 50 hours. All right, thanks, Jelly. That really means a lot. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Thanks for hanging out again. As always, it's always uh, good to see you in the chat. So, hope you have a good rest of your night. guys yeah I want some stamina back there I was like about to run out of stam Uneven uh, terrain with them there. It's kind of annoying when that happens.
Ain't nobody else. Is everybody? Let's do this. Check on these, uh, check on these extractors. Oh, cool. Okay, this is, uh, done. Here, like, this freaking skeleton over there or something. What's going on down here? Heck out of here. And there's a y'all floating around, man. Fading. It's fading still? We can get back to uh, pulsating with energy or whatever. Fading. So uh, they're all fading still. All right, well, good to know. Just wanted to check. Freaking y'all around here. There he is. Heck is this crap, man? Nope. Okay, there he is. I want to get him over here. I'm over here, dude. anything? Nope. Didn't even break anything. Yep, have a good one, Jelly. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you for uh, those kind words. Very, very kind. I think those are taking weather damage, maybe. Maybe? I don't know. I just got this, uh... Just got this right there. Is this will it look better if I put uh, some trim on here? I still don't like it. 
Ah, I thought I was, ah, just leave it like that, whatever, it's fine. Get the heck out of here, dude. Oh, I don't have enough either. Okay, it's still fading, so whatever, I'll just come back. It's good to know, though, but I'll come back when it is... Come back again and check when it's uh, pulsating with energy. Or at least like put the uh, that's when I'll put those that's when I'll put the extractors down. That is when I'll put them back down. Gone in. Okay, secret soldier somewhere. Got that guy. Get in here. Start blasting. Okay. this guy. Oh, two star. Okay. And a tick. Alright. Another uh, secret coming on in. Find out what's uh, hanging out down here. Get out of here, dude. Just seeker broods, that's it. Oh, okay, all right. Oh, you're dead. Sucker. Grab that. Don't need any more seal brick fragments. I already crafted the uh, whatever seal breaker. Yeah. Grab that certain core. Those two. Those black cores. Hey, nothing back here. Nothing over there. This looks uh, cleared. What the? What's that? A tick? Or is that a seeker? a seeker. 
I totally missed them. Soldier down there. Okay. A bunch of clicks. All right, took them out. All those certainly cores, man. Tired chest full of certainly cores. Don't really care about those. Okay, I got this guy down here. Okay, some kicks, some seekers, a lot of seekers. That's yeah, boys. Definitely some boys. Yep. Bunch of boys. Off this dude. Oops, wrong one. Wanted that lingering stamina, but whatever, it's all good. That works. Alright, just me and another secret guy. Secret soldier, let's go. Ah, didn't load it. What are we doing? Ceased. It's good. There's another secret soldier somewhere. Grab these. Man, I don't even know. Where are we going next? Jeez. Something behind here. Let's see what's going on. Anything behind here? No. That's uh okay, that's like the, the upper area, alright. We are already there. What about over here? What's going on? Nothing. Okay. Maybe just clear out like whatever whatever whatever's going on back here. Looks like looks just a hidden door, alright. Oh, too much crap. I don't need this. Alright, some black cores. Let's go. Anybody hanging out? No, that's cleared. Uh, looks like we're going... Going down.
do it anymore. that we missed any lanterns down here no don't need black marble let's grab this uh, bridal jelly over here and right here don't want to miss out on that nice full we'll stack full we'll stack of royal jelly awesome going up Two stuck there. Yeah, you got that guy. That's all cleared out. Nice. You can still hear some dudes. Where are these guys? Probably up top. Up top. And to the left. All right. Down below. Got him. All right, still here, you guys. Still freaking here, dudes. Um, I'd rather just uh, have some more secret meat instead of that secret trophy. Still not cleared out. It's uh, yep. Yeah, some guys back there. Right. Secret boys hanging out. Oh, okay, one star guy. We're going down here. That's where we're going. Come on, guys. Right, here we go. And your one star buddy, where is it? Where is he at? Let this guy go over here. Barrier up, but it's all good. And where's this last guy? One more. Or is that all of them? Is it just oh, there? It is. Oh, nice. The backstab shot on him. Nice. cleared out. That's a big one. That's a freaking large infested mine. Bunch of good stuff from that.
just gonna put that uh, this is an infested mine and I can come back this is one of the ones where you can like get a bunch of black marble from it so I'll come back and if I want to just uh, deconstruct it and get a bunch of black marble Some random wisp, wisp tower with a with a guy stuck in a rock. Nice. Farewell. Farewell, diverger dude. Stuck in a rock. Mistlands is nice looking. It's really nice looking. When you can actually see stuff. Let's go over this way. Tested mine, another one. A lot of mist. Hmm. I don't really know what I'm getting into, but let's we'll find out. Let that one see through. I wasn't even aiming for him, I that was kinda lucky. Just shot him. This rogue right here. Let's leave him alone. As a secret soldier somewhere. This one starts tick. Uh, he's dead. Oh. Another tick. Got some dudes back there. Yeah, this is the burger gate. Oh, okay. Where the heck did you come from? Okay, there's our secret soldier friend. I'm going in.
I'm, just, I'm gonna go this way, see what's going on. Yeah, let's get this back here. Thought there would be. Nice indoor. Let's go with the uh, black core. Nice. Uh, what am I dropping off? Don't need that. Don't need that. Or some extra wood. That's fine. Don't need it. Got the uh, poison resistance, so I like never have to make it again. Miss some royal jelly back here. Diverger gate. Okay, that's every. I think that's everything over here. Jump on down there. Get Arbalist, Arbalist loaded. Jumping on out. Nice hit door. Let's go. Black core is awesome. Okay, this uh, bottom area looks cleared. Not really sure what's going on down here. I eh, got, uh, got some ticks. Dead. Other seeker back there. Nice. So, freaking black core. Let's go. All those dudes. Another diverger gate on that side. And okay, nothing back here. Don't need that. Probably some guys behind this. Oh. Another diverger gate. Boys, what's up? There we go. Anybody else? Anybody else survive that? No? Oh, some ticks. Awesome. That is cleared out. Yeah, let's drop that copper. Getting pretty full. Might need to empty them out pretty soon. Oh, 
much ooze do I have anyway? Pretty good amount. Could make 45 more ooze bombs if I wanted to. That's good. Cleared out. So uh, let's leave this guy alone. And that jump skill up, nice. What are my skills looking like anyway? Knives halfway through level 88, nice. Elemental magic's getting up there. The crossbow's getting up there. Super. Where's that coming from? Okay, something down there, nice. Let's go check it out. Let's float on down. Watch for your blast in there, dude. Okay, got a rogue. Got the uh, mage. Another rogue. Got some soft tissue. Bunch of wood. Oh, nice. Got, got some lanterns. This is the best part. And another mage. Seeing two rogues and two mages. That's it. Looks like I think one of them got taken out. I saw some soft tissue there on the ground. Sounds like... Oh, is that this? Uh, that's some, just them running around. Where is this guy going? Set some copper out. Okay, let's go check on those uh, extractors, see how that's going. on something. Here. What's this? Pulsating with energy. Let's go. It is time. It's time. All right. Awesome. It's time to put the extractors back down. Let's go. Gotta see, like, let's check it out. How many? How many does this have over here? This has three. Yo. Step away from my stuff. This one only has two. All right, let's put another one down here. Don't need those. Mm. 
It's fine. Okay, extract it down. Three of them on that one. I want to put like, I want to get three of them on each of these. Super sad Viking. I only have two down here. Oh, I just need one more black metal scrap, come on. How many is in here? Just one? Alright. Oh, I want that hair. I want that. Deer's running around. How many do I have here? Okay, all three. Let's put these down. Oh, I just need two coal. So, whatever, I'm just, I'm just gonna use this. It's fine. Oh, and, uh, never mind. I already have the uh, the five, whatever. I don't know what I was thinking. That, is that one? Where is that? Is that one going down here? I think. So it looks like there's a y'all maybe around. All right, awesome. Three extractors on each. And all I need is just like 10 of Yggdrasil wood for another one. Oops, uh, needed to delete this guy first. Just leave that in there. And just leave this artisan table in here too. Right, the extractor, centralized extractor hub is operational. Let's go. It looks like there's a y'all somewhere, but I don't hear anything. I think. Yeah, I don't know, man. I don't hear anything. I'm just gonna get out of here. I might, come, I might like set up even more wisp torches around here. Just wisp, wisp torches everywhere around here. I don't want to get sconces on all of those uh, little like work, work, uh, work benches. Get sconces on all of them. I think that would look kind of cool. You know what I haven't been doing? And I, I, uh, maybe I don't even need to though, because I'm, I'm not really here. I'm gonna say I could have some some of those hens laying eggs, but it'd probably be a waste of uh, whatever I'm feeding them.
Oh, no, there's uh, some guys here. Some burger dudes. We're gonna take off. See that uh rogues running around. What's that other mage? That mage. All right. so it's like in a stupid spot up there. Okay, he's dead. You're dead. And this rogue, this rogue doesn't even care. You don't even care, dude. Alright. My goodness, dude, listen. Four lanterns, let's go. Launch a soft tissue. Tractor. Bunch of hairs running around. Cool, let's see if we can get a chain from this thing. Yes? Yes, got it. Awesome. Portal, just gonna grab the portal. Extractor, got an extractor there hanging out. And the best part, grab all these lanterns. Yep. All the lanterns. Can't, uh, I got too much crap. I'm just gonna drop that. Most important part is the lanterns.
Alright, don't really want anything else, so uh, let's get out of here. Fuck. Just came out of nowhere. Is it like petrified bone under here or something? <laughs> what is going on, dude? This must be. Oh, okay, okay, I see it. I see it. There's a petrified bone there. But it's like underneath, it's like in the rock. Those uh, ticks are just popping out of the woodwork, man. It's freaking coming out of the rocks. Alright, not a whole lot of mist. Right here, that's pretty nice. What a beaut. Can't really uh, see anything, though. Okay, that's the part that we haven't really been to yet. I'm not really seeing much. Okay, there's uh, I see a one star, one star seeker down there. A couple of guys. Are they down here? Is there something cool? Something cool over here? No. Let's keep jumping around. Yeah, not a lot of mist, that's nice. See a seeker down there. Couple guys hanging out. Got to miss them. And a one star guy, a couple of them. All right. Okay. That's when that minor, minor eider, whatever, is uh, useful, man. Really useful. Situations like that. Can't believe he didn't die. He's almost dead. Yeah, you hit him one of those minor eider, it doesn't even matter if you just have, if you just have like one eider food, your eider, at least you're using the Staff of Frost, will regen faster and it's uh, going down. So you can like just really lay down some stuff on him. Did he get a chain? No chain. Darn.
guard just spawned in the sticks. He's like, ah, man. I'm boned. He's shooting at something over there. Not really sure what. Who's over here? Did I miss out on some soft tissue? I think I did. Where's that guy's uh, bile bag? Oh, here we go. Up here? Don't want coins. Got a y'all trophy. There's this bile bag. Nice. Take that over a uh, secret trophy. And no room for soft tissue. That's not very cool. Um, I'll just like drop this, this stuff off then, and I can go grab that uh seeker trophy too. What's it up here? Uh, maybe not. I can't remember. Even, can't remember where I was at. Not a big deal. It's just a super trophy. Not a big deal. A decent amount of soft tissue. And it's like get some of this going. Heck is that? Oops, no stam. Oh, come on, stamina. Well, there's just like some seekers in here. No, nobody. I was already, I was already over here. Weird. So I didn't realize that thing was uh, right next to it. Uh, Seek soldier down here. Mad. 
Oh, I missed him. some guys over here. What is this? Nice. We got a mage, got a rogue. One star rogue. One star mage. Jeez, just a bunch of support mages. It's like four of those, two rogues, and another rogue. Lots of soft tissue. All right. Set up over here. Yep. Let's see y'all. Just heard him. He's like really close. Homeboy is close. There he is. See your stamina back. That's such yes, so. What's your favorite biome? My favorite. Oh, well, the Mistlands is my favorite biome, dude. What's your favorite biome? I was just gonna keep shooting this guy with the arbalist. Yep. You're dead. That bile, that bile bag. Some guys over here too. Dang. Looks like a bunch of rogues and a mage right there. Nice, nice. Yep, definitely miss lands. As far as we've gotten to be the swamp biome, okay. Cool, man. Swamp is good. What kind of armor are you? Uh, what kind of armor are you wearing? Taking out any abominations.
going up this way. Yep. One? Alright. Keep on taking out those abominations, dude. Get the root harness. <clears throat> Excuse me, the root harness, the uh this thing. Right? It's the um it's resistant versus pierce. It's gonna help you out in the swamp with all those dragger. It's the the archers. Basically basically gonna do no damage against you. These dragger archers, you know, even like two star ones, you just never have to worry about them again. And then in the uh the planes it's gonna help you out. Against death skeetos, it's gonna um if death skeetos do pierce damage, it's gonna like basically make those dudes do no damage to you, hardly any. And then the yes, and then the um the fallings with the spears, they can they're kind of annoying, they can hit kinda of hard. So they're gonna do like no damage to you too. But let's take this guy out. Nope, not allowed. Uh move over here. Okay, you're dead. The rogues are coming over. Okay, missiles, maybe. Okay, we have uh, a couple of missiles coming in hot. Let's get our bubble. Let's get this guy. You're dead. Okay, stamina. On these. He's dead. This guy. This guy's freaking dead too. You're dead. There's that rope there. Okay, go. Okay, I got one more mistal, I think. Not sure if that blew up on me or not. Okay. I think I got one more guy. healing. Okay, he's dead. This dude, come on now. Alright. It's all of those guys. Okay, come back for it. Where's uh, this next, where's this other one? There's one like right next to here. I think we can see it. I'm gonna go, go go to that thing too. Just gotta find out where the heck it is. I should have marked it down. This case, it's not over there. Where where is it? That's one we're just at. Should have marked it down on the map. Nice, we'll do okay. Right on, dude. Yeah. Root uh root harness. And then the root the root mask is really good too. Root mask is really good. Because it, uh, and I'm wasting my arc there ability because it, uh, it, it gives you poison resistance. So basically, you wear the root mask in the swamp. Anything that does poison damage is like does like no damage anymore. Here we go. So root mask, poison resistance, root harness, pierce resistance. You're chilling. Let's figure out who's here. A couple of a couple of these guys. All right, and a one-star rogue. Okay. Yeah, he's mad. You're dead. That rogue. Oh, who else is shooting at me? This guy. Let's just get some stamina back. Yeah, I won't have to make the poison resistance potion anymore. Pretty much, dude. Um, I would still use. So wear the root mask when you're fighting bone mask still, and and also just uh, do some poison resi uh, pop up poison resistance uh, mead when you're fighting them too. It'll just give you super super poison resistance, like 
fighting bone mass. Okay, somebody is mad over here. Who's mad? who's this? Oh crap! Okay. What the heck? Some freaking more guys. Who's this? All right. Okay, let's uh, reassess the situation over here. It's a uh, fire mage in there, so. And there's a y'all right behind me. Maybe that y'all can go over there and bother those guys. Oh, there's that fire guy. All right. They followed me. Maybe that. Yeah, maybe y'all. Uh, maybe that y'all can bother those dudes. I gotta take out that fire mage. Maybe that y'all will do it. I'm just gonna spectate for a second, see what's going on over here. Okay, mage uh, is still over there. So I'm on fire though. Oh, I missed. Maybe I can hit him. I can like see their outline. I can hit this dude. I can't see that yell's health. Kind of want to just like leave him around. Oh, there it is. He uh, y'all is like he's still chilling. Looks like he's winning. Y'all might be winning, dude. Oh, uh, okay, got that mage. I kind of see his outline. Oh, I can't see it anymore. Maybe just throw a couple fireballs over there. Maybe not. Hey, y'all are still over there bothering him, man. Fine with me. I missed that guy. Missed him. Okay, let's uh, reload here. I'm just wimping out, dude. I'm wimping out. I'm letting y'all do the work. Y'all's doing the hard yards. Somebody died. Y'all's doing the hard yards. Just want to take this guy out. Huh, <laughs> you forgot about me. When, what a silly guy. Okay, y'all's right here. And he's dead. Oh, there's the ticks. Take them out. I want that bile bag, dude. Is there a bile bag for me somewhere? Did I pick it up? No. Alright, I'm going in. Let's use left. Who survived? Sorry, dude. I had you. Okay, there's a one star rogue, right? Okay, missiles coming in hot. Make this guy heal. Just do some heals, dude. I'm gonna take this guy off. Keep uh, healing yourself. Alright, nice. Grab all these goodies. Some hair meat. Awesome. Okay, is anyone else left? Ooh, there's a big one. This is one of the big ones. Nope. That's our buddy. Awesome. Yeah, 
Heck yeah, let's freaking go. All right, <clears throat> so I clean up here. Pick over this, go back to this portal. I marked where everything is, so I'm not gonna forget where all these are. Seeker meat or great or fives. Take that trophy. Got some soft tissue up here and a lantern. Sweet. Bunch of soft tissue. Alright. Let's put down a chest. Extractor. Boom. Pick up this lantern. There's another one up top. Yep. Super duper. like a kind of a note that um, if I want to I could come back and like deconstruct this thing for a bunch of black marble I'm not gonna do that right now oh here's a vial bag nice got it and got a uh, excellent freaking A lantern, a couple of lanterns.
Well, maybe we can get a chain from this thing, too. Chain? No. Darn, no chain. Oh, I did get a chain. Awesome. Got the chain. Fantastic. And I got a, I got a bunch of stuff on me. Again. So, I'm just gonna like drop the scrap off. And let's drop the scrap off. Alright, uh, let's, uh, let's, let's deposit some things. Okay, I got an extractor there. And this is the uh, last one over here. And just need to take the ward down. Ah, oh, crap, dude. Oops. Alright, nice bunch of uh, soft tissue. Awesome, got the extractor. Some more soft tissue. A couple of lanterns. Let's go.
Just mark down that ancient sword right there. There's an ancient armor right there too if I wanna wanna come back for it. All you, like, if you wanna get a stone cutter, all you need is two iron. And uh, you can just get it from those. Got some ticks. Sounds like right above me. Where are you, dude? Where's this guy? Hello? Got the file bag. Let's go. Heard something over here. Yeah. Where is this secret soldier? this dude I can you hear him he's like is he over here Boys, boys showed up. Right. Where's the secret soldier? He's like over here. Reveal yourself. The heck is this guy? I keep hearing him walking around. We're here. Yeah, he's gonna be over here. Other side, all this crap. It's like on the other side of this, alright.
There he is. That's a one star here, nice. Some puffs, definitely grab the puffs. Let's do let's go. Alright, what's this? It's an infested mine, it looks like an infested mine. Yeah, it's just a bunch of probably a bunch of secrets hanging out. Oh, I missed. Let's see who else is hanging out. Top. Yep. So uh, check this out. What the heck, man? This ancient root in here? No way. No way, dude. Um, maybe I can just bust this open. Yeah, I should be able to just do that. I could get, I could get a pickaxe too. How much damage is that doing? It's pretty stupid that this ancient root is right here. Okay. Now we can get in. And get out. Yep. Thank goodness. Super duper. Let's 
see how uh, the sap is coming along. How's this going? 10 out of 10? 2 out of 10? 2 out of 10. Fading. 2 out of 10, 2 out of 10, 10 out of 10. 1 out of 10. Okay. Nice jump skill. Level 80. I think it's pretty safe to assume that, um, the rest are going to be the exact same, so just uh, come back when all of them are filled up, which probably, I don't know, maybe a couple in game days or something like that. Got some more meads, drop these off. I don't want, I don't want five of those. Okay, and barley wine. I make like some more of that. Because it's really cheap and really easy to make. And yeah, I use a lot of them. Bonus. Get some new foods going. Grab some more meat platters. Ticks. That guy's that uh dude's mad. Okay. Two super soldiers, let's go. And some kicks. Two of these out. Up 
turn around. I'll be alright, I'll be just trying to get in here. Get out of here. Alright, it's dead. Okay, it's almost done. Nice. I guess flapping around, right? And that secret soldier go there is. I want this dude to get in here. There we go. Big boy. Uh, too much crap. Right. Don't need a seal brick for everyone. Bunch of black cores. Alright, that's uh, this area down here cleared out. Dang, that's a lot of lanterns. Freaking lantern central, man, holy crap. Okay, that's our entrance. Maybe just like work on this area back here. Maybe this is just some... Oh, there's a hidden door right there. Oh, I think this is, uh... Everything. Except for this, hidden, got this sneaky hidden door in the corner. A couple of hit black cores. Let's go. How many is that? Seven? Nice. Here you can have that copper. And... That wood. Take that. Take some more of that. And I want those coins because I'm super rich. Super duper rich.
Um, do I want a secret trophy? Yeah, over a tick trophy, I'll take it. Alright, nothing back there. That's eight. Damn. I really don't. I don't even need seeker meat, really. Okay, hidden door. And so it's this way. Alright, cleared up. Oh man, too many ten ten certainly cores. Nice. It's a lot of seeker me. A lot of seekers died tonight, man. It's always nice when uh, there's like not a lot of mist. Just looks really nice. It's pretty, I guess, pretty big looking mist lines, man. Uh, whatever, let's let him go. Get some stam, there we go. Something down here. What's this? Some more boys. Oops. Okay, it was all chilling. Rogue. Another rogue. Mage. That guy. 
Anybody else outside? No. Oh. Okie doke. Some soft tissue. Yep. And a bunch of lanterns. Nice. right there. There's the other guy. Petra Bone. Where's the other row? Oh, there he is. Running around. This guy is right there. guy up. It's like four lanterns chilling. Nice. Let's go. To drop that. Got these lanterns for sure. It's starting to rain. No room. Oh, yep, got room. And grab all the soft tissue. Decent on soft tissue. It's touched by bone here. Oh, uh, see if we can get a chain from this thing. Um, if I just drop one wood. Yep, got the chain. Nice. Awesome. All about those chains. The only mod I would ever consider adding is craftable chains. But I'm not going to do it. Let's just go bomb the swamp. You get like six. I usually pull like six, pull like six to eight chains a night, usually. I'm really trying hard.
all ringy, man. It's kind of annoying. And pretty dark. It's probably not the greatest thing to watch. There's another one. Freaking another one, my goodness. Alright, these ones, this looks like the big old one. These uh these usually have some baddies in here. Usually like seven or eight guys. Well, let's check it out. The mage got the rogue, rogue. That's three of them. Let's check this out. Uh rogue. Uh, one star, one star fire guy, that sucks. And this rogue up here. Alright. There's the mage down there, it's the basic bro fire guy. Alright. Farewell, I'll be back to you. I'll be back. Okay, I got a minute left, and I can use Ike there if I need to. Fire resistance. And reds, and we are wet, and which uh, helps with the fire. Just gotta worry this like that one star guy up there which probably take him out with the arbalist. He wants to go back. It's not happening. Okay. Made his buddies mad. There's the fire guy, fire mage. Let's go to these. Not sure where he's at. Let's get the arbalist ready to go. Yeah, there's a rogue. Not seeing the mage. Oh, this is Barry. It's all good, he's dead. Where's this guy? I think he's, he's coming around this way. No. There he is. Missed him. Okay. Fuck me. All good. Oh, a couple of seekers showing up. Boys, watch seekers. Yeah, it's a mage. Yep, get out of there. Psych there if I want to. And he doesn't really care. He does not care about getting shot with the Arbalist. Whatever, I just take my time. Take my time. Just keep shooting him. Yeah, you missed, dude. I got some fire too, man. You're dead. Okay, 
Okay, let's switch check. See if there are any uh whoa man that guy that guy messed this place up. Holy crap. Homeboy freaking ruined it. That dude is so mad. Destroyed his own home. Holy crap. Crap, yeah. Alright, uh, let's drop, drop stuff that I don't really need. Let's drop that. Got some soft tissue right here, some blue jute. I got the burger trophy, nice. Got another one. Get some stamp. Okay. Let's grab the lanterns. Oh, oh, I got that soft tissue right there. all that soft tissue. You know what I can do? I can just hit up with some fireballs. If I can't get to it. I mean it's right here. Yeah we got it. I right, got that. Oh, looks like there's some over here. Okay got that. Wood. Oh, I don't need that. Okay, yeah, I'd rather have the fine wood. Fine wood. Cool, another lantern. Somebody's saying something. It's gonna be mad. Like, what? No? Just seeing stuff? Uh, drop some stuff off. Four seconds, huh?
Where's the extractor? There it is. Ah, it's just chilling up there, man. All right. I gotta look at how many extractors I've gotten from over here so far. It's gotta be at least like seven. I think. Might be worth bringing back to the extractor spot. Got some puffs. Nice. All about them puffs. The heck is this? Bruh, it's another one. Okay, a couple of others. Uh, some rogues, a bunch of rogues. Hey, who's hanging out in the basement? Uh, man, that's... Man. That is, that is uncool, man. That is uncool. All right, okay, now can you, can, can you guys like come up? Can you guys come up? Can you make it? Are you gonna get stuck? I think they're gonna get stuck. I don't think they can get up. All right, man. This one. I'm freaking cheese this one. A little bit. Not like super duper cheese, but I'm gonna cheese this one a little bit. I'm gonna grab uh, this guy just in case. Defender's coat. I need this.
sure to throw a fireball on him. Investigate. They're dead. <laughs> I am not. I am not going down there, man. There's no way I'm freaking running my butt down there. With those two fire guys down there. No thanks. So I'm just gonna wimp out. And uh, do it the way that where I don't die. out there but I'm alive and they're not Tasting me down me for some reason. Uh, I forgot to drop off the fender's coat. Um, oh, if, I, if I have inventory issues, I'll just drop it off later. Just keep it on me for now. It is kind of useful having it on you. But I found, I used to just keep it on me all the time when I was in the Mistlands, but I found that I hardly ever used it. It really comes in handy. I guess if you're um, going after a y'all. What's up, sick puppy? 
Still going hard? Yeah. I'm just gaming, dude. Just gaming Friday night. Got nothing else going on. Just freaking gaming. Don't get lost. Thanks, man. I'll try not to. But, uh, yeah, I used to keep the Fenris coat on me all the time so I could, like, have the full Fenris set. But, in a, when, um, I guess it comes handy when you're, if you're, like, taking on a Yawl. And you get that plus 9% movement speed, which, which is pretty cool, but, um, the root harness, though, I just feel is, like, a lot more useful. And when you come across a Yawl, you know, you want that, that fire resistance. Just the barley wine does just as good. And if you have the, just do the root harness with barley wine. When you're getting going against the y'all, if those ticks come down and they latch on to you, you don't have a barrier on, then uh, you're not like totally boned because they do a lot. They, they can do a lot of damage if you don't have that root harness for the pierce resistance because they just do pierce damage. So I'll like sacrifice uh, five percent movement speed for like some some super duper pierce resistance in a biome that has. Or mainly a lot of, or a lot of the creatures just mainly do pierce damage. Cause like plus four percent movement speed is still really good. You're still zooming, still zooming around. It's not like that disgusting freaking ten percent movement penalty that you take with heavy armor. A oh, secret soldier. He didn't even see me. What a what a goon. What a freaking goon. Maybe I can get a butt shot on him. No. No butt shot. All good. Sit up. Finally changed headgear. Sometimes. Sometimes I do. If I go into an infested mine and there's like, uh, freaking seeker soldiers and crap, I'll change over. Oh, I got pooped. I do like having the carapace helmet on me though. Um, just for some extra uh, damage resistance sometimes. Going up again, like uh, I, I just I think the last infested mine. It might have been the last or the second to last one. Um, there were like two seeker soldiers in there, and I, and I was like in the uh, same little area with them same time I switched over to the carapace helmet because if you get I guess it's, I mean, it's still got the barrier too but if you get booped by those guys it hurts oh, where that guy's going nice and put down the old portal right here Still at, uh, you still at work, sick puppy? Did you get off work? Still grinded? Man, I wonder if we'll get a chain. Chain? No, oh, yep, yep. Freaking sick. Another chain, let's go. Let's freaking go, dude. Heck yeah. Take nope. 
too much carapace. It's a lot of carapace, dude. A lot of seekers perish this evening. Off work, watching you the rest of the night. Try those weapons today. You're using awesome. Do you like them? Which weapons is uh, specifically here? Like all, like my entire, like this, all these right here, or I uh, have this one, this summon in particular. He's starting to really accumulate the lanterns, man. That is good stuff. And it's just uh, drop off, drop off Thunder's coat. Still gonna go back and check on the sap. Really awesome to use. I never give, gave them a chance. All right, awesome. Glad you gave them a chance. The dual weapon, the skull, the skull natty, the knife. Three out of ten. Ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. Let's go. Still fading. All right. Let's. let's oh, wait, wait, wait. is this one uh, all dried up? Two out of ten. Ten out of ten. Hmm, okay, that one says it's all dried up. These ones don't, though. So I'm still gonna wait. I'm gonna wait on it. Yeah, it's just fading. 3 out of 10. Both those are 10 out of 10. Let's go check on this one down here. Fading. 10, 10, and 4. Alright, I'm just gonna wait till they just fill up. Wait till they fill up. Or if they're all just like say that they're dried up and it's been a little bit and they haven't um, produced any sap then I will just grab the sap and uh, take them off still getting to learn what's the best method for for uh, the old sap collection um, since we're here, probably a good idea to get uh just get arrested. Bonus pack. Uh, what are these? What are these guys. Let's go grab some more um, seeker aspect. I'll have to make some more of it. Lucky it's super duper cheap. Super easy to make. I might just like fill up. Maybe you just do like two Yggdrasil Porges, I don't really use those a whole lot, and then just do like the rest of Seeker Aspect down here and keep uh, for 40 Seeker Aspect in the uh, reserve back there. Yeah dude, so do you, uh, do you use the, any magic stuff? In the magic uh, items. For me, the the funnest and uh, from moment, moment, what I like the most is a uh, combination of the melee stuff and the magic stuff. What is going on, dude? This is bonkers. There's so many Diverger PIs. Oh my gosh, dude! This one star mage. Freaking one star mage. Yikes. Okay, that's the dude, uh, all of them. Just the fire guy, this guy, one star mage guy, two star rogue. Oh, dude, this is. And it's like really enclosed. Like... Dang, man. Yikes. Ugh. Dude, there's there are some freaking baddies here, dude. Yeah.
Looks like I'm wearing the Fenris helm. It confuses me. I am. I am wearing the Fenris hood. Yep. Fenris hood. Got it. Look at him. Look at them all just hanging out on top. If I really wanted to, I could probably just like just go up here. Take out the Arbalist. And just start blasting them. Thinking about it. Thinking about it. But they got this uh, support guy though. They got the support guy. I don't think that's a viable option. Unless I just take... Unless I take the support guy out. That's pretty wimpy though, man. That's a pretty wimpy way of doing it. Um. Dang, dude. Some freaking baddies here. The only dudes I'm worried about are the, the main dude I'm worried about is that one star frost mage, and I'll probably just. I think I'm just to save that guy for last, just avoid him. Probably take out the uh, the two star rogue first. Take out the two star rogue first. Take a look at like they're all just hanging out, dude. They're all just throwing it up on top here. Okay, just ba basic old rogues. Don't care about them. Don't care about this guy at all. Fire mage, nah. You know whatever. But that dude. That dude's freaking bad. Bad news. Where did that rogue go? There's a two-star rogue. Like, where did that guy wander off? Where did that guy go? Where did he go? He's unaccounted for. Where'd that guy freaking wander off to? What? Do these ticks take them out? No way. There's no way ticks took out a two-star rope. Maybe they did. No. Nope. Okay, what's going on? Oh, y'all time. Oh, right, here we go. Maybe y'all's gonna help, so. Let's go. Yo, let's go. A one-star, y'all. Holy crap, dude. Fire resistance, fire resistance barley wine for sure. I want to see what happens here. We can spectate. Maybe uh, I don't got the Fender's coat on me. Yikes, dude. One star, y'all. I think they just come out at night. It's like a nighttime spawn. Maybe this guy can do some damage. I'm just uh, totally gonna avoid him, though. I'm totally avoiding him. Where'd he go? Is he dead? They take him out? Yeah. Wow. Yikes. Watching your previous videos, notice you haven't died yet. Is this a hardcore challenge? Um, not necessarily, but uh, I am trying my best to stay alive. I'll tell you that. I don't want any of my skills to go down. Look, I got, dude, I'm level 100 run. That's pretty sick. 89 knives. Like, I don't want these skills to go down. No way. I worked real hard for these skills. So, definitely not uh, trying to let that happen. Oh, uh, we gotta do this. We gotta do this, though. Actually, uh, okay, if we're doing it, then. Yeah, we gotta go back. Gotta go back. Gotta grab a. Uh... Let's just get, like, a full rest of bonus. And I need some of uh, that frost resistance. I think that two star rogue is dead. I don't know. If he's dead, then I might go after that one star, uh, one star dude right away. I think I'm gonna do that and get the Fenris coat. Fenris coat. Flesh rippers. Uh, full rested bonus. Bogdan Bago. 
You good it gooded. Yeah, dude. Pretty much. Get get good, noob. Yep. Yeah, I don't want my skills to go down, man. So I'm doing my best not to die. So I'm doing my best to stay alive. I like putting it I like putting it that way more. Doing my best to just to stay alive out in the uh Valheim, man. Oh and uh frost resistance. Bonk. Thirty run skill day two fifty five dude sick puppy come on man what is that dude what is that bro really really dang man I'm just kidding that's okay all right. I'm just gonna, okay, I gotta, I'm gonna do a once over the area. See if this two star rogue's hanging out. I don't think he is. I think he uh, wandered off and died. I don't see him. Uh, Fenris Coat, because Fenris Coat is resistant versus frost as well, as well as uh, the fire resistance for the full set. Um, Flesh Rippers. They are, they are equipped. My, what is my fist? 17 plus 15. All right, this guy. He's coming down here. Come with me. Still got, uh, man, this is freaking scary business. This is scary. Right, you're gonna come up this way. Go over here. Get Ike there. Somebody we can run around. Nope. No, 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 there's that rogue. Alright, come up here, dude. Me and you. No, nope, missed this fairy. Missed the fairy, but I got I'm a bubble boy, so I'm all good. Okay, uh fire mage. Nope, not allowed to do that. He's dead. They're not allowed to do that. Get the barrier back. And we're chilling, dude. We're chilling. Who else is left? Not sure. I think the uh, actually the support dude's left, so it might have some mistles coming in hot. Maybe. Let's get one of these. Nope, I missed. One of these. Nope, missed again. Oh, this is gonna be. All right, let's get up here. All the way up, all the way up. Hot, up, 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 okay. Okay, get some stamina. Uh, bonk! One of these. Oh, Nistel. Nope. Darn. Okay, where is this Mistel? Right. Yep, let's blow them up. Okay, yeah, that rogue. Rogue doesn't even know. Rogue forgot about me. Rogue forgot about me. No. Okay, I think he's gonna do his. No, he's gonna do his heals. That's so fine. Yep. Uh, missed those coming in. One of them. Nope. Missed. Okay, so took it out. Jumping around. They're just on crap. Uh, this this crap terrain, dude. Okay, he's. Doing something stupid. Where's that? Where's that rope? 
Yeah, there he is. This goofy guy shooting the ground. Arbalist duel. It's crossbow duel. Oh, I missed. He's dead. Alright. Not, not as scary as I thought. It's gonna be um at Weekend Warrior. Any Soulsborn experience? No, I'm not even sure. I'm not sure what that is, dude. And that's why I'm liking you, uh, like watching you at the moment. I learned a lot watching you how to get uh, copper and black marble. Awesome, dude. Copper is for copper in the Mistlands. Probably, uh, I don't know, man. Like, probably not the most efficient way of uh, of getting copper because uh, you just gotta you gotta. So, yeah. Probably uh, bring it back quite a bit of a ways, but it's a lot more fun than whacking a copper deposit. But taking out the diverger, the, these diverger things. Somebody else right here. I heard somebody. I, I heard somebody. But black marble, though, definitely. Okay, just got a rope left. Yeah, taking these things down for black marble. Dude, like, I think uh, you can also get it from those, uh, what is it, the petrified bones, like the ribs or whatever. Oh, dude, no way am I whacking those things for, for uh, petrified bone. Absolutely not. That is so not, not, that is so not fun. Ugh. No thanks. Okay, the extractor. Where is the extractor? Is it up here? No, that's just wood. Did I pick it up? Oh, I picked it up. All right. Gotta check. Uh, check the old inventory sometimes. Mark down where my uh, portal is. Check back here. <laughs> how funny is that? How funny is that? That uh, that two star rogue. I was like super. I was like kind of worried about him. He just went. He just like went off and died somewhere. Didn't even have to worry about him. What a what a silly guy. What a freaking silly guy. Silly pants. I was like, oh, dude, two star rogue. How am I gonna deal with this dude? He just like wandered off and died. Like wandered off to that uh, petrified bone, I think, and uh, some ticks just took him out. I think I'm pretty sure that's what happened. He needed uh, should have been two star rogue should have been wearing that root harness, dude, for the fierce resistance. Should have been wearing it. Let's put some of this junk back. Alright, excellent amount of certain cores now. That is just really like seeing that. An entire re love seeing an entire reinforced chest just full of certain cores. Just put all the portals down in the entire ball and world. Never have to worry about it. Never ever, never ever have to worry about certain cores again. Noticed I don't uh, che I noticed I don't cheese any bosses. I didn't learn about them until I beat Yoglith. I'm not gonna lie though, I cheese the queen. What did you do for uh, beating the queen, dude? What did you do? There's nothing wrong with cheesing. Nothing wrong with some cheesing, man. I'm not gonna hate. I play uh, 
I haven't played it in a little while, but I love uh, the Total War. The Total War franchise of games. And uh, I really like... I, I haven't played that much of Warhammer 3, but I absolutely love Warhammer 2. And I freaking cheese the crap out of the AI in Warhammer 2. But I also play on, like, Legendary Difficulty and with very hard battles and, like, uh, you kind of, I don't know, sometimes, man, like, you just kind of have to. I, I still have Fender's Code on me. Yeah, sometimes you just gotta, you just have to cheese in Warhammer. Makes you don't have to, but it makes it a whole lot easier to win battles. But Warhammer 3 I haven't really played that much of. I just saw uh, I like Warhammer 2 a lot more. I should get back into playing some Warhammer though. Spawn. Yeah, I like Total War a lot. Uh, I like um, just getting off topic from Valheim stuff. I like uh, Seven Days to Die. I have quite. A, I have like I don't know, maybe uh, eight hundred thousand hours in Seven Days to Die. Uh, Imperion Galactic Survival is a game that I played a lot. I have some content on it, but I don't. I never play Imperion anymore. But that's a uh, another survival game out there that uh kind of played for a little while. There's another one, dude. This is like, this is ridiculous. This is freaking ridiculous. Yeah, Imperion, um, Conan Exiles. I have, I have like, uh, Conan Exiles is like the most watched content that I have on my YouTube channel. Even though I don't, I honestly don't. I don't really care about Conan Exiles all that much, which is uh, why it's just kind of frustrating. Like, on my channel, a game that I don't really give a crap about is a game that um. I have the most like views on one star rogue. All right, I don't really give a crap about Conan. Another rogue. The sledgehammer cheat, right? You at least two hundred hours in seven days. All right, that's pretty good, dude. I, I I love seven days to die. I freaking love seven days to die. That is one of my favorites. Uh, second favorite game, probably definitely uh, behind Ballheim. Freaking love Seven Days, dude. Such a good game. Played some, uh, I played quite a bit of like Factorio though too. I love Factorio. That's an awesome game. Even though I haven't, I probably I haven't sank some serious hours in Factorio in like a couple years probably. Ashland soon? Hope so, dude. Valheim building mechanics, I think, is uh, way better, too. Like, I'll actually... I actually, like, enjoy building in Valheim. In Conan Exiles, I literally... I just make a freaking uh, crafting platform. I don't even make a base. It's just a freaking foundations that I stick my crafting stations on top of. My opinion, it becomes lame when you get the drill. Um, like the uh, the uh, auger. You're basically rich and do whatever you want. Yeah. I guess. Check on this, see how it's going. All dried up. All dried up. I think they're all dried up. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. To 10. Every, everybody's 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10 would extract again. Let's go. The auger, okay. Gotcha. 9 out of 10. Come on, man. I'll take it. Alright. This is what I've been waiting for here. Twenty-three. That was ten. Nine. Ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. Why do I only have twenty-three sap? Where did my sap go? It's got jip, man. I know that two of them said ten out of ten, and one of them said freaking nine out of ten. 
the heck. Oh, uh, I got 24 sapphire. Okay, so I'm just gonna have these chill. I'm gonna put them in the chest. And just wait till it gets back to, um... It says that they're, uh... Uh... uh what is it, um... Oh, uh, it says that they have a lot. I forget what it's called. Freaking... Okay, 30. Nice. Okay, cool. Got all my resources back. I should have brought the belt with so I could like... Oh, oh, oh my gosh, I think I, I didn't grab the freaking sap. I just missed... I, did I just miss out on all the sap? I don't know. I just missed out on all that sap. Hope not. I guess let's find out. How much is that? Yeah. See, what, a, what a thumb bump. I think I deleted it and all that sap. All that sap's gone. Rip. Okay, yep. Six of them in there. How much sap is that? Alright. 108. And I'll just wait till it says uh, it's pulsating with uh, pulsating with energy. And then I'll put the uh, extractors back on. Like, now nah, I'm just freaking falling out of control on the sap. Actually, yeah, that's a good amount. Like, I can make 40 egg crystal porridges and still have a bunch of freaking sap left. I think there was just a one star, uh, a one star rogue at that one. Nothing crazy. of rogues. Okay, we got this guy. Mage. Yeah, just the one star rogue. And I think everybody's, that's, that's all the guys. Everybody's, everybody's here. This is one of the big ones. Oh, okay, another rogue. It's a bunch of rogues. And another this guy. It's like freaking a lot of dudes here. A bunch of dudes. A bunch of rogues. What mage? What kind of mage are you? All right, you're that guy. All right. All right. 
don't have Ike there yet, which is pretty lame, so one of these. Yeah, it's just kind of like wondering where I'm going. Okay, only one. Only, those guys aren't mad over there. Yeah, they're not mad yet. The other guys are mad. Yeah, they're mad. They're pretty mad. Okay, there's some missiles coming at me. I kind of just like let this. Okay, I don't see any missiles. No, maybe just let this guy. You. Have one of these. Oh. Yeah, I need stamp. idiot walking around. Dead. These guys don't even care. Don't even care. Alright. Over here. Yeah, they're watching. Alright. Right here. Nope. Where are you going? Come here. Over here. Right here. Yeah, his buddies are mad. He missed. everybody. Nice. Oops. Oh man, loading screens. Uh, the Minaris. Do you know if you get more XP based on the type of enemies you take down? They should do that, I think. You know, that's a really good question, man. That's something I've, that I've wondered. And uh, I I don't know I'm not sure what the answer to that is, uh, but you I would you would think that would that would be that would be pretty cool if it was that way. The option to buy a pre-built castle with gold, as long as there's proper rain to fill it, like in Valheim, dude. Bunch of soft tissue. Sweet. Hell yeah, make gold. Uh, oh, super useful buying ca uh, stuff for your castle. Yeah, that'd be pretty cool. And another use for gold. Wouldn't be opposed to that. And lantern, nice. Another lantern. Add it to the lantern collection. OK. 
care about the copper scrap really. Alright, uh, we have some wood. And I have enough uh, wood. Nice for a chest. Let's put that in there. Boom. Buy stations and stuff, just a uh, random thought. I built I build shoe boxes. Like uh bases. I build like shoe uh, a little shoe box base. Imperion has a mechanic called the uh, uh, not sure if you're familiar with the game at all, but it has a mechanic called the uh, the factory. And basically players can build um like uh different vessels like spaceships and uh, hover tanks and stuff like that you build them in um you can build them in survival you can build them in creative mode and then save it to uh the the work the steam workshop and other players can go in like uh and they can basically like uh add you know what if you if they like what you made they can add it to their work uh to their factory and you just have to um you just have to add the materials that it takes to make it and you can like um spawn it into your uh into your survival world, as long as you have those materials. Which is kind of cool. That's one of the coolest, probably one of the coolest features of that game. Got some puffs. Couple secret bros showing up. Wanna hang out? Building in Shroud is in. Is, whoa. Is it y'all? Pretty close. So the building in Shroud is uh, but you know, if you tried it, it's a, it's a good game, but I still enjoy the progression involved. Okay. Yeah, I've, I've never uh, played. I haven't played in Shroud. Looks pretty cool. Just haven't uh, given it a shot yet. But yeah, the building looks uh, kind of interesting. See all it's pretty close. Let's get this out. Where is this clown? Where is he? Where are you? Maybe just hit him with a fireball and so I can like track him, see where he's at. Where is this guy? He gave me his mad his like I really don't like him. Here he is. Where is this guy? I would like to fight right here. There you are. Big goop, goop ball. Oh, one star, y'all. No thanks. Never mind. Uh, this. Uh, you can have this uh, area over here, sir. No thanks. Totally went, but now I'm not. I'm not bothering with a freaking one star, y'all. I'm pretty sure that like you don't get two bile bags out of them, so it's like, eh. No thanks, man. I don't know how uh, how much damage their fire attack does, and I don't really want to find out. So, peace out, dude. Get away from that guy. Why builders do that too? Join, uh, join their patron. They uh, advertise it on their videos. All right. Scale hide that I missed. K 
can't take it because I got oh yeah, too much junk. I don't really, I don't need any more secret meat for a good while. So is what you got on you, uh, the final gear loadout? Where that's what you uh, would take the Ashlands? Um, it just depends on what the Ashlands biome is like, dude. Like what uh, what kind of damage the cre what kind of damage the creatures do. Um, yeah, what uh, kind of what kind of resi if, 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 if if like some certain armor sets would give uh, resistances that that would help you out there. That that really just depends. That's what it depends on. But uh, I'll tell you right now, I'm probably not going to be wearing heavy armor. You would think that the Fenris armor would be the go-to because of uh, all like possible, you know, Ashlands. You know, maybe like fire, stuff that does fire damage. What is this? There's another one. Yeah, it just kind of depends. I do like my light armor though. What's all going on down here? This is a big one. It's right next to the to the water too, so it'd be like a good little fishing base. You know, make convert it to a base and do some fishing for anglers and stuff or whatever, whatever you want to do. And one star guy, okay. All right, not on. There's not too many dudes in here for being really. B Unless there's some guys in like hanging on the water or something, something stupid like that. And are you planning on watching and uh, reading advice on it when Ashlands comes out? You're just going in blind and see how it goes. That's a good question too, dude. Oh, there's a bunch of anglerfish over there. Probably. Uh, I, I like uh, watching videos that content creators make on. Um, on, you know, like what uh what they think would be, I don't know, I don't know what what they think about it, and if they have any advice on stuff, I'll probably check it out. But I think I'm at uh, the point in the game here where I have enough hours where I can go in there and kind of check it out and figure it out. kind of a cool little base spot. Oh, I don't really like that. That's not like my favorite Diverger base, but uh, this is a nice little area for like if you had a boat, it'd be easy to take it out and and uh, go go uh, try to catch some angler fish. Take a full stack. Okay, cool. I can take a get a full stack of carapace out of here. There's a bunch of black cores too. That's pretty cool. Bunch of yoden puffs. Awesome. Black cores. Uh, I can put down some more. Put down some more um, black forges around the base just to have like you know stuff going on put down a lantern, I don't gotta like pick up my black forge and put it back down. Need some on a carapace. How is this stuff coming along? This is all done. Uh, a couple of lingering stamina meads. Yeah, make 
couple of those. So, uh, lingering stamina. That is cloudberries. Is it cloudberries and honey? No, it's not. I always forget what it is. It's um, cloudberries and I think uh, yellow puffs. Right? No, nope, not right. What is it? Uh, oh, I put the cloudberries back. Duh. that one uh, one star guy on the t on the very top and this one is like on a little island it's like almost on a little island so not a whole lot of eh, there's a decent amount of space to run around just got to make sure like that dude on top if he gets mad he might be start shooting some mistles so there might be some mistles flying around just got to be aware of that and really, if I wanted to, I could just like push all these guys in the water, but I'm not gonna do that. Alright, come with me, dude. Probably, uh, hike through. Oh, That's guys, are you gonna run the water? Are you gonna run the water? Are you going in the water? Yeah, you're going in the water. What a goofy guy. What a goofball. Dude took extra damage because he was wet. On the staff of frost. Where are the rest of these guys? Where are these guys, man? Are they up top? You guys mad? Uh, are you guys mad at me? Uh, hello? Okay, probably not the smartest idea to just go up there, so... Go ahead and not do that. Oh, here we go. Here's a guy. Are you mad at me? No, he's not mad. Okay. Come on. What's going on? Your stuff. Stuff's happening. I think stuff's happening. Oh, okay. Got a rogue coming down. He's not mad. Alright, everybody come on down. Come on down, everybody. Let's go. So, like, speed this process up.
are these clowns? What's going on here, man? Are they all are they are they on top? Dude, there's a one star. Next one on here. I don't see anybody. No way they're dead. Yeah, that guy. Missed him. It's mad. Gonna heal himself. Yeah, that's pretty pointless. Okay, there we go. Oh, oh missiles. Pretty sure, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm not getting hit by that. Not from one star row. One star dude, not a row, but. And it's a uh, uh, barrier up. Uh, just, just stuck. Is he stuck right there? Nope. He's down. Got him down. Got him. Okay, it's it's all the boys. Extractor fall down. Oh, I see it right there. Got it. Just want the lanterns, man. Come on, man. We, we can get up there. All right. That's gotta be. Lame mom, um, my ball. See that? There we go. The rest, of, the rest of the soft tissue. It's probably like some soft tissue right here. Yep, soft tissue right there. Let's get it down. Okay, I think that's uh, pretty much everything. It's got some copper. And a bunch of wood. I don't need that much wood. No, let's, uh, right now. Um, let's put a workbench down. Okay. I have the extractor on me. It's going to go in there. Keeping track of which ones I can deconstruct and which ones are just just like have an extractor at them. Okay, grab this. Actually, do I need do I need to go grab the portal and bring it here? I can just kind of just kind of like go over there. I can just go over there. Soft tissue. How much uh, did I get here? 19. Don't think there's any more. So grab the lanterns. Grab the lanterns and bounce on out of here.
still haven't been down this way, so check it out. Some puffs. Always grab the puffs. over here what the heck dude this is the most amount of uh, these diverger bases in that I have ever come across just bananas freaking b-a-n-a-n-a-s bananas Placement, whatever, dude. Just let me put the. Just let me put this down. Come on. There we go. What is this, super soldier? All right, uh, I'm gonna guess that. I don't really want to do it this way, but yeah, the cross mage is gonna just go to town on that guy. Oh, what's up? Yeah. Oh, if uh, that mage is getting messed, you're getting messed up, dude. Oh, he's dead. You're dead. That guy's dead. This uh, one-star guy is. It's kind of just doing the job for me here. Jeez. Yeah, you better watch out there, bud. The one-star dude is messing around. Is he gonna, is he gonna, is he gonna get him, like, take out all of these guys? I think he's gonna take out all of them. That's, that's one way of getting uh, an extractor, I guess. Alright. It's just me, dude. Last one left. Dude, that one star is secret dunked on. It's freaking slam dunked on all those divergers. Holy crap. Freaking dunked on them. MJ free throw line. Tongue hanging out. Dunked on those divergers. It's pretty lame, man. Like, I wanted to. I wanted to take them all. It's not cool. Uh, I don't need don't need seeker meat. Uh, like three blue jude isn't really doing a whole lot. Yeah. Grab that. And just take the ward out just cause. Let's see if I can get a. Uh, some certainly cores out of it. Yep. Cool. There is so much black marble over here if I wanted to get it like all these things that I could just take down my goodness chests upon chests upon chests of uh, black marble my my goodness
all that secret meat. But um, this is honestly like, this is more secret meat. And uh, I might just leave it. Uh, uh, my man, I got extra, I do have extra storage back here. This is kind of being used for black marble at the moment. That's got a bunch of copper scrap in it. Lanterns. Yeah, I might need a. I mean, I, yeah, I might need to like extend the uh, storage. Probably like, extend it to here, and uh, maybe just put a. Probably just put some lanterns in here for light. So I want room for the cart. Definitely want this. This is very, this is pretty useful. Just being able to put the cart in here. I need to take two carts. I have two carts chilling, ready to go. Okay, let's uh, take a look at this. Just want to count all of the, uh, how many extractors I have. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fourteen extractors. next to Plains Biome. I mean, I could just, like, sail it up to here. I already know, like, I already know the route to get there. I just go boop, freaking boop, all the way up here, and drop them off at the, the, uh, the old sap farm, basically. hanging out down there. Looks like all uh, the water. Yeah, some are feel kind of bad for them. We got like some, some water down there. Okay, it's nighttime. It's kind of dark in uh, these in the old boar pit and like where the hens are over there. But I'm not not really not really worried about that. Or else is it pretty dark? Puts those lanterns there, so like it's got some decent light now. I guess it's kind of dark over here too. Just thinking of all like the spots where lanterns should go. dudes it's been like six hours and it's 12 o'clock in the morning here so I think I'm gonna end it in the stream here um, but uh, just keep it keep it going uh, I gotta take the Queen out and the Queen is chilling over here so we know where she's at let's take a look at the skills maxed out run Probably work on getting that sword skill up, but I really want to max out knives. So, like, if I if I start having a, I don't know, if I want to just do one thing at a time, like max out knives, and then really want to get uh, fists up for uh, flesh rippers. Flesh rippers are like really good. Get the element of magic up still. The crossbows up. Yeah, I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna end it. Um, tomorrow's. Tomorrow's might be a little bit more chill. I don't know. I kind of want to do some base stuff like, uh, 
get this all converted over to black marble. Like we see like the inner wall. The inner wall is stone. The uh, top portion on this side is stone. That's stone. I want to change that over to black marble. Basically everything. Everything. I want to change everything over to black marble. Like the, even like the, the stone. Uh, it's all stone here on the inside. Like the, the floors. I want to change those over to black marble. And do that. Uh, some other base stuff. Um, get lanterns going. So that means like farm in the swamp. Farm in the swamp for those uh, wraiths because I need more chains. That's basically the bottleneck on uh, lantern conversion, converting everything to lanterns. Um, what else for base? Uh, that's pretty much like uh, the main base things that I want to accomplish, and then uh, eventually, uh, I mean, get that uh, diverger base. Get a diverger base up. It's kind of dark up here. Maybe some lanterns should go up here. Yeah, let's put like a couple lanterns up here. I'm gonna do that right now. Let's put some lanterns up there. If I put a uh, like, do I have coverage? Oh, only up to. There's still a, no. Okay. No prob. Got a bunch of black cores. Got uh, the wood. That's why I got all these. That's why I'm, I'm gonna spend my black cores. And I have uh, black marble. So I'm gonna put uh, one, put a black forge. Oh, do I already have one? No? Oh, it just needs a workbench. I think it, so. It's okay. It's kind of. Can I see like where the kind of like where it, where it ends? So I can put it like right here. It's right, right in the right in the doorway, I guess. Like I don't, I don't use this to like go around. I really just yeah. It's really mainly used yeah to like do this, but put some um, stone cutters and stuff back there. Black forges. I want to put a. I can put a. I'll work on um, adding up. I want to add a, f add a forge, like a regular forge, this guy, to each corner. I um, just need a couple of diverger lanterns and uh, some copper. That's why I brought back like all that copper. So mainly, it's mainly just gonna be used for uh, lanterns. Do one of these guys. Like one right here. And one right there. Awesome. Go actually bring deliver some boar meat real quick. I don't really need to uh, rest the bones right now. Some boar meat for the uh, automatic, the automatic freaking resin farm. I uh, I re revamped this thing earlier today. Uh, that green arc, great arc. I still want these guys out. Okay, yep, we got that wolf. Got all the self back. Good deal. Awesome. Some stupid dog. Everybody got their health back. You can see, like I um, they added this, added these stone floors, so the uh, uh, workbench and stone cutter are completely enclosed. They don't won't take uh, stupid damage, and I just added some storage to this thing. So 
Sounds like there's some fallings upstairs. Kinda careful. Three of them. Hmm. Yeah, that's pretty stupid. chests in here for this crap. Like a bunch of wood, a bunch of stone, tons of resin. Dandelions for our uh, hens. It's like, uh, but this, this has been like the first time I actually made one of those things. And uh, holy crap, dude, I can't believe I waited so long to make one. Got so much resin from that thing, like lots of resin. Yeah, all right. I'm gonna end it here though. So, to thank everybody for watching, um, hope everybody has a good one. Stream probably stream tomorrow, and um. We can do some more, maybe do some base stuff. Uh, we can go on the Mistlands and keep uh, keep the adventure going. Eventually, go check out the Queen. Be cool, to, like you do it tomorrow. It'd be cool. Get the Queen on. My my magic stuff skills are getting uh, pretty decent, pretty decent level. But thanks for watching, everybody. Hope everybody has a great. It was a good one. Now, if you liked it, leave a like. If so. All right, bye. All right. Thanks for hanging out, Jetso. But uh, yeah, I hope everybody's going and uh, take it easy.